morning. It's uh, October 7th, Wednesday, October 7th, I guess, um, 2015. Um, I haven't made one of these for a while, and um, I don't know, at least an hour or two. <laughs> um, um, I don't know, maybe I'd like to increase views, I should say. What is that, a fucking wheel? <laughs> What is that? A fucking wheel? Look at, look at that fucking thing. <laughs> uh, you know what, man? If any, I think if any of this shit ever went the least bit viral, that would be the end of me. I, I, I don't need that. I don't need that at all. I, all I think I need is a new pair of um, glasses. I don't know. These kind of have like a Clark Kent vibe. These are actually like bifocal, so when I look down, it's like a totally different... I don't know. Like I can see... It, it's like a little disorienting, but... Anyway, I got them, and um, I'll just hold on to them in case I, I sit on the other five pairs I have. I, I have a backup. But um, anyway, I wanted to tell I wanted to tell this story. I was talking about this yesterday. I said this story, this thing that I was hearing yesterday was so funny that it has to get out. It has to get out of my system anyway, and then we'll be on here. And uh, I hope this guy, I hope this guy is able to has a forum to tell this story because it's probably one of the funniest things I've ever heard. And um, I'm not definitely, definitely not gonna be able to do it justice the way he was able to tell this story. And um, uh, I'll set it up that I was. Um, a couple of days a week, I go into halftime pizza down across from the garden um, before uh, before going to work and uh, have a have a slice or two. And um, you know, I've always loved halftime. I got good pizza right now. But anyway, um, uh, that's neither here nor there. Uh, so I was sitting down uh, at a booth, and um, this guy was across the way <laughs> telling the funniest thing, funniest story to his friend. And I don't know if it's true, and it doesn't really even matter. But uh, he was he was talking about how he was an extra on um, uh, the movie with um, about the Whitey Bulger movie uh, with Johnny Depp and uh, Black Mouse. And um, anyway, he, he was saying. <laughs> How oh, they called him, they called, uh, like I said, I'm definitely not going to do this justice, and uh, I'm already babbling way too much, but anyway. Um, so anyway, he said, they called him, I guess, um, you know, to, to be an extra, and he, um, you know, to say they had to be in, um, I don't know what time they were filming, like a parade scene the following morning, and he was like hedging and hollering about the time or whatever, and the guy's like saying, listen, you know, we got like 500 other people we can call here, and, um, you know, do you want to do it or not? So finally he, he says, yeah, okay, whatever. So that's funny enough to me, like, you know, the, like the guy's like, what do you mean like five in the morning? <laughs> and so he finally, he so he decided he's going to go and, and show up, and um, I guess they were, they were filming it down uh I don't know where they were filming the parade scene, you know, probably down in Lena or somewhere. So he gets there and um, um, he has to be in the, the crowd for the parade. So uh, there's some extra handing out uh, flags for the, for the, I guess it's supposed to be the Southie parade. I haven't seen the movie, so I have no idea. Now I want to see it because I want to see this thing. But so uh, the lady's handing out the extras, hidden, not the extra, the, whatever they call those people, the casting person, whoever, whatever that title is, best boy or whatever, those key gaff, <laughs> key grip, <laughs> is handing out the, the flags to the, the, the people, the, the 500 extras. And um, I guess it would be a St. Patrick's Day flag, I would assume. So I don't know. But, um, or a white flag. <laughs> Whitey Belton, please don't kill me. But anyway, uh, handing out the flags. So uh, he has this little flag, and um, and Johnny, he says, this is his story, not mine. Johnny Depp comes over to him, and, uh, you know, uh, he, Johnny Depp. And he says to him, okay, you know, he's like, okay, man, let's go, let's do this, let's do this scene. So according to the guy telling the story, he's like, I couldn't even understand him, because he's got, like, this voice that's, like, the pirates of the Caribbean voice or whatever. You know, he's, like, got this really weird voice. So that made me laugh. <laughs> Cause he does have a he does have a weird voice, so he's like fine. So they start filming the they start filming the scene, and he he whacks Johnny Jeff in the face with the flag. <laughs> he's waving. So they've already started the parade scene, I guess. Uh, I, I like I say I haven't seen the movie, so I can't really uh, you know visualize what really how it happened. But just the fact he hit Johnny Jeff in the face with the flag makes me howl. So. So they they had they, the director yells cut, 
and comes over and he's like, "You have like one thing to do: wave the wave the flag." And um, you hit you hit Johnny in the face, you know, whatever. So then, um, so this 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 just goes on for a while, or whatever. And uh, they, they, I guess because for whatever reason they had to keep they couldn't replace him because they already had the the film they had to keep this guy in the the flick i guess because it was the the whole scene revolved around whatever i don't know i really couldn't understand that point of it that why wouldn't they just get rid of this guy because he seemed like he's been very difficult (laughs) but he's already in the thing so uh so i guess the line that got me was the the extra the guy who's telling the story at at halftime said that he turned to johnny's f and he says listen you know listen dude and I'm thinking of like him saying this, like, because he sounded you know, a lot like um, the guy. I think that's the reason I brought up the, the fish video there on the, the, the YouTube sensation there on uh, from the guy from Milton. And he says, "Listen, listen, man, you got one friggin' line, and all you got to do is nail that line. And frankly, frankly, Johnny, you're not even getting the line right." So <laughs> he says that's Johnny Depp. So. <laughs> So anyway, um, you know they 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 do it again, and the guy, the, the extra messes up, and, <laughs> and like I'm just laughing because the whole movie now is revolving around the extra and, and what he does instead of Johnny Depp. So um, and unfortunately. <laughs> You know, as the guy kept going on, and I'm like running, and I'm like looking at my watch. I'm like running late for work, and and uh, he finally got up, and then he went outside to tell the rest of the story to his friend there. And um, you know, I, I'm hoping that uh, maybe he can. See, I'm making these videos now, hoping like people will see them and then like re re. Because I'm I'm hoping that he 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 says and he finishes the story because. Um, I don't know, like he, and then, well, his friend said, it's, it's the scene in the in the movie, and he says, yeah, it is, he says, you can see me, so I definitely want to see the movie and see that, and um, I just thought it was really funny, and like I said, there's no way I did it justice the way he was telling the story, and I'd love him to make a video of it, because <laughs> it really just made me laugh, and, um, you know, uh, you know, it's, it's funny, you can be sitting there, it's like the scene in Seinfeld with, um, the ladies like over here in the story about uh, you know George and um, uh, Jerry talking about uh, uh, she's uh, you know how it is she's all of, a, all of a sudden she gets the idea that they're gay or whatever but uh, <laughs> and I, I said I was up to the right so it wasn't like I was like you know like eavesdropping from behind me but um, it was a funny story all right I'm done and uh, eight minutes of nothing <laughs> that maybe that's why I don't at least go viral. <laughs> It's just available, but you know what? I, I like it that way. It's that's the way because um, you know somebody will somebody will get a kick out of these uh, fifty years from now, and I don't I don't need any notoriety. I get uh, I get this, <laughs> and I got my catchphrase, which is adios, and uh, I'll leave it at that. Adios.